Hello everyone, welcome to some basic tech and today we will talk about how you can load your profile if it is not loading due to some uh, sort of reasons. Okay, so uh, there are multiple reasons and uh, if you read the message carefully, the user profile service failed the sign in, user profile cannot be loaded and loaded in the sense uh, due to some sort of disk space it is not getting loaded and uh, maybe the profile is corrupted during windows update or reboot time okay so i will let you know couple of way to fix this so let's start uh, to reduce the disk space first okay so you just need to know the workstation ip address or host name and uh, this is my another machine where i am trying to fix the that machine because i am not able to log in okay so uh, i'm going to open run and type the ip address of the machine and simply hit enter you can simply double slash and then ip address you have to type like that and then hit enter it will show you the c drive and then you can go inside the c drive users and search the user that you are already in a part of this machine and then you can you go through the folders and delete some to reduce this sort of space uh, around 3 to 400 or 500 MB once you reduce the space you will able to log in okay just reboot the machine and then try again you will able to log in this was the first step how you can fix this this is very smallest way now the second thing is if you are able to log in and somehow the profile is still getting in a, only this profile is not loading uh, but the admin profile is working fine so what you could do on that situation you can simply log in with the other profile uh, like i am doing rdp and uh, just connecting the machine using the other way and uh, suppose this is my admin profile and i am logging with this user i am in the machine now okay now so first of all what we can see we can just you know go to the profile and see if the user have any sensitive data that can be copied so it can be copied from here okay it's easy to copy and then uh, you can for removal part we just need to go to advanced settings and uh, that is possible to go from here as well click to this pc right click and then go to properties once you are in properties you will see advanced settings system settings okay just click on it and once you are here you will see user profiles advanced tab user profiles desktop settings related to your sign in you can clearly see okay now here you can see that if the profile is created suppose like this okay simply click on it and uh, this is the default profile that i logged in that's why the delete message and all is uh, offline but if you logged in with the admin profile and the other one is not uh, you know useful and you already you already is created then it is going to show you to delete that simple and you can simply delete and this uh, deletion part will completely remove the profile cache and every data and then you can reboot the system and try to log in again simple so this is how these two way can help you out to fix the issue and if you are still uh, occurring this issue or having this issue then you can simply comment on the video i will let you know as soon as to you know uh, fix out the issue okay if you like the video and if you uh, feel that video is helpful then you can simply subscribe and just hit like button thank you so much